Hey there everyone, welcome back to Technoholic. If you are someone who value a smooth, efficient file management experience on Windows, then in this video, we will talk about one such file management experience. Hey there everyone, my name is Pritam. In this video, we will talk about files, a powerful modern file manager that just got even better with a release of files version 3.6. So let's see what now it come up with and then we will also talk about how one can install it. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so now here we are in our computer screen and let me actually open the site which is files.community. After opening the site, you will see the direct download link although we can directly download it from here but before we download let's see what are key capability of this file manager and do we really need it okay so here you can see it comes with multitask with tabs so let's say if you are using the older version of windows for example windows 10 then windows 10 does not comes with this kind of multitasking Although I would say Files was the first file manager that came up with this multi-tab capability. So this point definitely goes to Files as they came up with this feature even before then Windows. Now the next feature here is Dual Pane which gives user the flexibility of viewing and managing two folders side by side with Dual Pane feature. And I think this feature recently got added with this recent release of uh, file 3.6 and here you can see the capability being added in this particular version and as I was mentioning this new version also comes with a dual pane mode that we will also see in a while when we install this latest version now let's go back here where we can see more capability of this file for example tagging file and folder which i would say is really cool in terms of efficiently categorizing or organizing your files and folder then we have got this column view and so many other features that you can see it here now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna click here on download and then here you will see these two options so i would suggest you to go with the stable build and then if you also would like to support this project then i would definitely encourage you to donate some amount to developers especially we should if in case we really like the product now i'm going to install the stable version of it for that let's click on download file and it is basically taking us to microsoft store now here we simply need to click on install and then here we can also see the average rating of 4.2 with total um, 959 rating. I would say this rating looks really impressive considering the rating of other softwares generally we see in Windows Store. And then here we can also see we have successfully installed it. Now here this screenshot also talk about the different different capability of files. Now let's try opening it. And there we go. It looks slightly different. It comes with this quick access. Uh, what actually I can do is I can actually place the Windows Stock File Manager and Files File Manager. And here we can clearly see the difference between both these file manager. I would say the file manager on the right hand side looks more minimalistic and clean even compared to stock file manager of Microsoft Windows. Now here we can see the drives then uh, if you have any cloud drive, network, WSL, tags and so on. So I would say I really like the whole structure of right hand side file manager which is files now um, here we can see the setting option that also include many other option and then we can also change the appearance of the file based on our need we also have option to change the layout type which again i would say is really nice to have feature now here we have got several different different kind of settings available which you can tweak or play with to achieve or to get your own custom files that will help you to manage your file and folder inside microsoft windows now let me actually close it so this was a very quick introduction and how one can download and install 
files latest version in their PC. I hope guys you find this video helpful and informational. If so then please do like and subscribe to Technoholic to see more such content and I will catch you soon with one such another video. Till then you take care and bye bye.